Morning all. Hi, it's Karen here. I'm just in my art shed. Don't mind me, I've not done my hair or my makeup or anything. But I just thought I'd uh, make a few little bits and pieces today just to, you know, make some cheery things, some easy craft. So very, very easy one this is. You just need some string, some cupcake cases that you're not going to use as cupcake cases, um, some leftover ones. Obviously, they, they haven't been used. <laughs> Um, and some glue and something to add the glue with. Okay, so I'm starting with 10 cupcake cases for each little ball. And for each cupcake case, I'm gonna fold them in half with the print on the inside, like that. Cupcake case of the 10 folded in half. And now what you're gonna do is you're gonna put a little bit of glue on this side here just on one side there and you're going to stick that side of glue to that side without glue so it just goes like that okay so that's what that looks like see these two sides are glued together now hope you can see that you need to give it a good press all the way around Make sure, especially down to the fold here, that it's all nicely pressed together. And then the next step is to put glue on here and to stick this glued bit to this unglued bit again. Repeat the process basically. So you've got three of them stuck together now, just like that. And we're going to repeat again. Glue on this side, sticking onto unglued this side. Same. Once again, it's four stuck together there now. Uh, glue on here, stick to this one. Three stuck together now like this. There. Well, I'm going to put that to one side and I'm going to repeat the process with the other five here. Two halves now, two halves of each globe and that's five cupcake cases stuck together there. And the same here. And what I'm going to do now is just fold it up nicely and just leave it flat and I'm going to leave that to dry for a little bit. Same with this, nice and flat there and just leave that to dry. And now I'm going to get to that stage with all my other cupcake cases which I've got here, look. These are counted out in tens. Okay, so I'll join you at the end of that. Okay, doke, so now I've done enough for six globes. Okay, because you need two of these to make one globe. And the next thing I'm going to do is just go to each pile and just start to reinforce that middle fold. Just kind of do that, push it over like that and fold it. Just make that as crisp as possible. And the other thing I'm going to do at this stage is if there are any of these where you haven't quite got them together, can you see there, there's a little overlap there, I'm going to trim those down. So that's what I'm going to do next for all of these. Okay, so the next step is to get your two halves with just one ply here and one ply here. And we're going to add the string. Okay, so we're going to put glue on the whole of this put the string in the middle like this and then get this second half and stick it on top like that so the single ply to the single ply this is what you'll end up with so you've got something that's starting to look like a globe now with a piece of string going from one end right down to the other end so and I've already attached it on the string to my first one that I've made there so I'm just going to carry on carry on just adding another one by taking two halves and gluing and put the string through the middle so this is what you end up with rather a nice little garland been buffeted in the wind at the moment in my garden. Anyway, quite fun. Hope you enjoy making it. Take care.